Tonight, a 102-year-old Verona great-grandfather is fulfilling his final wish. New at 6, Kevin Larson's got you covered on how he became king of the tennis court one last time. Waiting patiently, like his grandfather clock. Well, I hope it goes over the net, not into the net. <laughs> because Warren H. Webster... I am really looking forward to... Uh, getting down there and say hello to everybody and taking one last swing the amazing thing madison didn't have any tennis courts until uh, i would say the late 30s and warren born in 1915 102 anything else you'd like to know yeah warren can you play are you ready go warren that was fun what a shot warren didn't just serve the ball he also served his country. You know, the phenomenal thing about it, and he denies a lot of it, is that you take World War II, that he was the highest decorated Thunderbolt fighter pilot in the Battle of the Bulge. He saved thousands of lives in the installations he took out. Madison tennis legend John Pallas is astonished at what his friend can still do. Ah. Driving his own car, coming and going from here. And while Warren's pace is just starting to slow. I, I, I've had it. <laughs> I got to get over to any time fitness center. Jokes aside, Warren's time oh, for God's sake. is precious. 102 and hitting a tennis ball. Um, <laughs> I deal with patients of all ages and health conditions, and none are quite like Warren. Because even his Grace Hospice Cares team is amazed. I wanted him to bring his walker. He would have nothing to do with it. So I was a little worried he was going to fall, and uh, he still has some moves. Catherine Larson, 27 News. What a guy. Warren has 20 great-grandchildren and says the secret to his old age is simple, eating eggs and bacon every day for breakfast. Good advice.